So what's going on in the real estate market, May 11th, 2020? Well, that's what I'm gonna talk about today. Stay tuned. Hi, Annie Baker here, talking about what's going on in the local real estate market in Silicon Valley. We are still in shelter in place, dealing with this COVID situation. And even though some things are starting to open up a little bit, it's still impacting the real estate. And I am not gonna sit here and tell you exactly what's gonna happen with the real estate market because I don't know, nobody knows. And I am trying to just tell you exactly what's happening with the stats that I have and not make any big predictions. I still think there are a lot of buyers out there and the interest rates for mortgages are still fantastic. So I think buyers will have a lot of buying power when they start to feel comfortable coming out of their caves all of our little caves that we're stuck in in our houses. So I think everything's gonna be okay, but again, what do I know? So let's have a look. What's going on with the numbers in April for our local market? So let's first start off with some general numbers. What has actually sold in the month of April in 2020? And then I'm also showing you the stats from the last you know, four years going back to 2017. Basically our numbers now are looking very comparable to the February numbers in 2017. So it's not like, oh my gosh, nothing's selling, no one's buying. It's just April is typically a really busy month and a lot of homes are sold. So we are definitely off in that regard. So let's take a look at a specific area. Let's, I'm doing Almond and Valley in San Jose. So the number um, of houses that sold in that neighborhood was 26. Compared to last month, there were 25, but a year ago there were 38. So clearly not as much um, moving in terms of selling. Um, the median sales price is uh, really not off too bad compared to a year ago. Uh, now it's 155, it was 158. Last month was 177, but um, you know, maybe they just had more you know expensive houses that sold last year. The days on the market are pretty consistent. You know, the things are still selling. Ten days, nine days last month, and ten days a year ago. That's how many days it took to um, to go into contract. There are only 25 new listings uh, this month, though, compared to 32 last month and 40. So the number of homes that were put on the market was down, and um, the price per square foot is down. The average price per square foot at $664 compared to $690 last month, $686 this time a year ago. So now let's take a look at another part of Silicon Valley, Sunnyvale, in the 94087 zip code. Uh, there were 14 sales in the month of April. Last month they had 23 sales and a year ago they had 30. Uh, the Median sales price is down a bit, just over two million. It's a little over 2.1 last month and almost a little over two million a year ago. Uh, it took eight days to get into contract, which is pretty standard, seven days last month and eight days a year ago. So that's showing there's still demand for some of the houses that are coming on the market. Uh, there's 20 houses put on the market, 21 last month and 34 a year ago. So I really think that's an indication that people, sellers are also being hesitant. Should I wait? What's going on? Are there gonna be many buyers out? So I think there's gonna be a lot of sellers just waiting for this time to be over. Then they'll be putting their house on the market. Um, the average list price was um, that they received was a little over the asking price. So that's still great. And the average uh, price per square foot was down just a smidge, 1,200 a square foot versus uh, 1202 last month and up from this time last year. So again, that's to me is showing that there's still some strong buyers out there that will pay for a great house in a great location like Sunnyvale. One thing I liked looking back at these stats, uh, for the days on market for April, 2020, uh, for all of Santa Clara County single family houses, the, it was 14 days on market to get the house into contract. That is still showing a lot of demand. This time last year, 2019, it took 23 days to get into contract. Yeah, there were a lot more sales, but it took a little bit longer to get into contract. And the um, average sale price 
Last year was $1.68 million for Santa Clara County. This year in April is $1.6 million. So it's the the overall average price has gone down 80,000, but the demand is higher in that it takes, you know, a week less to get something in contract. So thanks for watching. If you have any specific questions for your house, your neighborhood, please don't hesitate to reach out again. I'm here to serve you. And um, if you liked anything I had to say, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. I do these market updates every month. So come back next month in June and we'll see what happened in May. Until then, have a great one.